Welcome back up to everybody to episode 6 of Stardew Valley here on Krillix Farm. And as you can see, we just leveled up level 4 farming. Very nice. We got a little bit more of the proficiencies. We got a new crafting recipe called an iron fence. A preserves jar. I'm assuming that we can put things in there to preserve them into other things. That could be useful for sure. And basic retaining soil. All right, no clue what that does, but I guess we can find out. Oh, and we also got level three foraging. Nice. And we got a tapper. Okay. I'm assuming that that's like for maple syrup, maybe? Go full Canadian here. And how much money did we get? We got 3,600 from our parsnip, guys. Very nice. Not bad at all. Okay, good. So we just finished the egg festival, we just sold all of our stuff. <laughs> And we need to get things going. So, new day, beautiful new day. Let's, of course, go with the normal. Check the weather forecast. Partly cloudy with a light breeze is all. Spirits are very happy today. Okay. Well, that doesn't line up very well, sadly. Um, I learned how to cook coleslaw. Not bad. Uh, sadly, it's not going to help us very much because... We have a bit of farming to do. We won't be going into the mines, I don't think, today. We have a very busy day ahead of us with all sorts of farming duties. So, first things first, let's water up the crops and let's see what else we can do here. I did get those uh, strawberry seeds, so you know what? Let's do some of that right there. Um... Is it three per, or is it two per? It's two saps per. Okay. So I need six. Good. Okay, we'll craft up this. I'm going to get some basic fertilizer, three worth. And we're just going to throw down the strawberries right here. Good. These do go in spring, right? Plant in spring, eight days to mature. I think we have enough. We do. Mature and keeps on being good. Okay, good. So we'll water these as well. Get the strawberries started. That's one of the advantages to that egg festival, I guess. And I guess other than that... No, don't eat the cookie. Boop, boop. Sell those parsnips. And get ready for the next harvest. So we have... I think we have all most of the spring crops at least ready to go. Hi, Faraday. Yeah, hello. Fill up your water bowl. There you go. Have a nice drink. Have a good drink. All right, so we have $4,400. That's pretty darn good. Not going to lie. If it was rainy tomorrow, I would have upgraded my watering can, but it's not supposed to be. So I think instead, all that we can do is basically, we got a book. Nice. Lost book, very good. Um, I think all that we're going to do is look to plant new crops today. That's probably the best course of action for us, I think. Uh, get the seeds, get some crops planted. It better not be like a Wednesday or something. That would be terrible. That would be really bad. And what's the quest? It's Haley's birthday. Okay. Uh, three carp. No, I don't have carp. Oh, God. It's locked still. All right. So, it's Haley's birthday today. So, we could be... We could get Haley a gift of sorts. I don't know what. What does Haley like as a gift? I do not know. Um, probably like flowers and such. Maybe we can find something. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. You never know. All right. Pierre's open. Excellent. Perfect. I'm just in time. All right. So I think... Should we just go full on parsnips again? It's pretty big though. Like that's a big field of parsnips. I'm kind of thinking that we should. Let's get... A thousand buck. Let's get a hundred of these. Yeah, we'll get a hundred. That'll work pretty good. 
That leaves us with 2400 bucks. Enough for a watering can if we get the opportunity. Or we could also potentially look up at Robins to see if there's something that could be built. That could be cool too. Um, other than that, I'm going to look for flowers and stuff. Let's go head on up to Robins and see exactly what we're dealing with here. And I've never really looked at the cost of some of these things, like the coop and et cetera, et cetera. So let's find out. So, uh, construct farm buildings. So a coop is 4,000. Ooh, okay. That's a little steep. Upgrading my house is 10,000. All right. We cannot do that. It is impossible to do that at this point in time. I think... Oh, what do we got here? We got a... Foraging item. A leak. Leak. Okay. Someone was throwing stuff at Linus. Maybe you should live in a house, bro. Bro, you should live in a house. People might not throw stuff at you then. If you live in a house. All right. I'm going to, so we got a little bit of foraging done. That's good. We got the 100 seeds that we can plant. That's going to take most of our stuff, to be honest. That's going to take pretty much all of our energy today, I think. So I think what we're going to do is I'm going to plant down all of our stuff and get ready for the next day because I think that's going to take pretty much the rest of the day. Uh, I am going to be missing Haley's birthday. I don't think she's going to like a leak for whatever reason. Um, does the book automatically go to here? Oh, and then you can read them. Okay. All right. Okay, very good. Kind of like tips. Okay, so you can find books and stuff to give yourself some tips and advice. That is good to know. So I'm going to plant all of our stuff. And yeah, we'll go from there. All right, so another quick sleep here. And ooh, we got a level up. Level 5 farming. Rancher or tiller? Okay. Animal products worth 10% more or crops worth 10% more. I, th I have a feeling that I'm going to be a little bit more crop based. Just an assumption. So I'm going to go with the tiller here, which is basically going to make our crops worth more, which is good. I'm all for that. Uh, so we got a little bit more money from the second harvest of the parsnip. That's good. Um, we will save that money. And I think for the most part, we just have to worry about watering our stuff and all that kind of stuff to start today. Forecast tomorrow, sunny. Okay. Uh, very displeased today on the fortune teller. Okay, good. All right, guess. Lots of pollen, like they said, and we have a message. Hello, dear. I know you're just getting started as a gardener, so I want to give you a little tip. Most crops only grow in one season. We already knew this. When summer arrives, your spring crops will all die out. So plan ahead. Yes, indeed. All right. So we have a lot of watering to do. As per normal, when we start out in our our day as farmers, um, definitely a lot of watering. Uh, just a little bit. It's fine. No big deal. So, a decent amount of watering and stuff to do. I'm hoping that we start to get some better foraging options. There really hasn't been much foraging that's gone on lately. And I've really explored around quite extensively. Um, it would be nice to have something else to do that's, you know, kind of energy free. Um, but, you know, maybe we should have gone in the mines more. That's all I can say. So, we'll get these guys going. Oh, we're out of water. We're out of water. We're out of water. It's fine. Okay. I also wouldn't mind trying the tree sapper things. Those sound pretty cool that you can get probably sap from them. That sounds kind of neat, if I do say so myself. And it does state, I wanted to show you guys this, on the crafting recipe itself, that it will work for maple, oak, or pine. 
So, that's the thing. It will work for all of them, which is good. You know, that way we don't have a uh, tree racism or anything like that, right? We don't need any of that. Okay, uh, doing not bad. I'm going to finish up the watering of these crops and probably not too, too much today. A little bit of wandering around maybe and uh, seeing what's available for us. Sadly, that's kind of the things that you need to do early on. I should probably be giving more presents to people and stuff like that, but that's going to dip into my funds. And if you're trying to build a big farm, you kind of need your dollars, right? Um, I did put fertilizer down for all of these crops except for three. So we should see a pretty decent harvest of crops the next time that they come up and are ready to go out of water again looks like the last little bit of watering that we need to do i know more watering oh my lord sadly we haven't had any rain or anything so upgrading the watering can really kind of a dangerous move when you have crops that need watering we're not really in a position to get sprinklers or anything like that i mean yeah we could but yeah, it's one of those things. So, um, we do have one cauliflower. That's good. We do have some wood. I really just... Why do we only have one clay? I thought I had... Oh, yeah, I sold it by accident. I remember now. It's fine. Hi. Hello. Hello. How's it going? How are you today? Doing good? All right, so I think we're going, I'm going to, hmm, we're kind of low on energy. I think I'm just going to chop, chop down a little bit more. Do a little bit more chopping on our property here and uh, get prepared. Probably do some harvesting as well. And uh, then we'll go from there. Or foraging, not harvesting. Ah, what is this? What is this? Give me your things. We got salmon berry. Nice. Okay. Cool. So a little bit of foraging action indeed is available. That is very good. So we can definitely look to get that going. Um, hopefully there's a few more of those. I'd love to get even more salvaging or foraging. Oh, yeah. Look at them all. Okay, good. This is... Very, very prosperous. Okay. I think somebody even mentioned this in the chat. That this might be a thing that pops up. Which is pretty awesome. Thank you. Appreciate that. Um, I'm going to keep on searching and harvesting everything. The salmon berries, the dandelions, all the things. So I just found the lost axe. It was right here. So I can return that to Robin. That is awesome. I didn't even realize that that's where it was. But I guess that's what you get for kind of exploring around and checking out things, right? Um, getting all kinds of foraging stuff as well. Hey, look, it's Haley. I missed your uh, birthday yesterday, Haley. Please don't hold it against me. It's fine. It's fine. All right, so I'm going to keep going, and I'll meet you guys up at Robin's house. All right, there's Robin. Let's return the axe. Nice, I did. Yeah. You almost chopped your toe off. All right, journal updated. What did we get? Robin's lost axe. A little bit of gold. Lovely. Nothing wrong with that. I do kind of want to find uh, Leia. Uh, so, so far today, I've given a gift to Penny. And I've already given a gift to Leia as well. Oh, Penny's already one heart. Hmm. Intriguing. I'd like to find Leah, or Leia. I don't know which way to put it, or say it. But anyways, I want to find her, and see if I can't give her a gift as well. Just to kind of make, well, you know. Friends. Yeah, I know. Oh, no, 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 I'm trapped. Uh-oh. Uh, a blacksmith. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. 
You're in my way. Thank you. Thank you. Whew. Got a little concern there. All right. Is Leah in here? Doesn't look like it. E. It's a bit of a gamble. Um, where's she at? Oh. Oh. Linus, what are you doing? What are you doing? Checking in garbage cans. Raccoons, eh? Okay. All right. And I see Linus. Well, you're wearing feathers and like leaves, so I'm not surprised. Hot, fresh food. Okay. Okay. Stuff that people throw out. I get that. Is there something wrong with what you're doing? Yes, it's disgusting. Okay. 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 Wait. Wait. Halt. Oh boy. Caught. Busted. Oh. All right. Good guy, Gus. Good guy. Okay. Well, that's better than going through the trash, right? I would say so. Okay. So we're still looking for Leia. Um, I don't know if she ventures out tonight or not. Bit of a circumstance. She could just be in her house. We don't have access to that. So what I'm thinking is we're going to keep a flower around for her for tomorrow. That we can give her. And then that would be nice. And then we could give another flower. So I'll keep these two dandelions around. To give to the two ladies. Penny and Leah. And we'll keep the hearts going. Get them all kind of hearted up for me. They're both going to want me. As per normal. Most ladies do. That's what I'm saying. Alright. So, uh, we're going to sell everything but the two dandelions, I think, for the most part. Uh, the clams can go. The mussels can go. The sea urchin. The daffodil... Yeah, I'm going to sell the salmon berry and the horseradish. I guess we could keep one. Yeah, we'll do one of each. Okay, that's fine. We'll keep those. Good. We also got some fiber. We'll put that away. And I think that's about it. Everything is watered, ready to go. Let's sleep it away. Hi, ZZZ. ZZZ. Let's sleep it away. Uh, we should get a little bit of money, which is good. We did. Clams and sea urchin and all the foraging that we got. Good. Those sea urchins are really good money. 160? That's pretty nice. We're already on the 16th of spring. That's pretty awesome. If I do say so myself. Forecast for tomorrow, partly cloudy. But still not rain. Luck will not be in your favor, okay? And we got we got mail. Dear neighbor, I hope you are feeling settled in your new home. I'm writing to let you know that Pierre's store is now selling fertilizers. That is good to know. Thank you, Pierre. You sweet, sweet individual. All right, I'm not going to bore you guys through the watering because that's what I'm about to do. Aha, Leah. No, I want to talk to you. Uh, um, 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 give you a dandelion. Thanks. Thanks. Did we get a heart? We got a heart. Nice. Uh, the next step is to find Penny as well. 
But I'm going to do a bit more foraging before that. Well, hello there, Penny. How are you? You're tutoring today. So nice. So nice. Uh, I have a dandelion. This looks special. It was special. It was special. Only one heart, though. What the heck, man? I went and found that dandelion specifically for you. It's fine. It's fine. They're very happy with me. They're already happy with me, which is good. That's one step up compared to some relationships. Just saying. All right, good. Uh, I'm going to keep on foraging probably the rest of the day. Got a few other places to check out. Make sure I'm getting all the things. Uh, is there a quest? Mm-hmm. Oh, three anchovy. No thanks. No thanks. Don't mind if I walk away from that one. All right. More foraging and another sleep. I think that's going to be it for this episode, though. I'm pretty sure we're at wrapping up point anyways. Um, so thank you all so much. I really do appreciate it. Subscribe, like, all that fun stuff. If you're here just and you've just found my Stardew Valley, oh my, I love you. Uh, but second of all, awesome. Love it. Thank you so much. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye for now.